Hello everyone, my name is Disquiet Mind, and welcome back to the channel. If you can believe it, if you're watching this video the day that it's uploaded, it has been one full year since I uploaded my first video on this channel. Uh, which is pretty inc insane, it's, it's pretty crazy to me, honestly. As I've kind of briefly mentioned before previously, I'm very good at starting new creative projects, I'm just not very good at finishing them. And I think the reason that I dedicated so much to this channel, um, even though it's only a handful of videos, they took a long time for me to make as someone who was learning. And the fact that I dedicated a whole year to making these videos, I think the reason I was able to do that is because there was a, this sense of inherent accountability. Because I put something out, and when I put something out on YouTube, there's that expectation that I will continue to put more things out, just because that's the way that the platform works. And I think that allowed me to actually stay motivated a bit more than I would if it was just me in my room doing stuff, you know? Because, of course, I have friends who know that I do creative things, and they also know that I'm very likely to not finish the creative things that I started. They know me well, they know my habits, and because there's that expectation of like, oh, well, Anthony's just doing the thing. He's not going to like finish it. Um, there's no pressure or expectation of me finishing it. And it's just like, oh, we don't care. Like, that's just what it is. And that's fine. But having this exterior motivation to finish things has actually been a big help, I think. And I, and I say that because I was thinking a lot about what I want to do to continue the channel because I, with working a full-time job and everything i don't know that it's super sustainable for me to keep making video essays the way that i have been just because they take too much of my time and maybe that's a skill issue maybe i just need to get better at doing it by doing it more but as of right now i just feel that they take too much time and effort for me personally uh, and where i'm at in life but I still want to make stuff, and I still want to put stuff on the channel, so I was really having a lot of trouble. And this is like the third time I'm recording this video, because it just started getting depressing every time that I would try to record it. Because I would essentially ramble until I came to the conclusion that I didn't know what to do. So I, I took the time to really sit back and think about it before trying to record this again, and I realized that I should use this channel, for right now at least, as a catalog of my creative endeavors. I still want to try to make them entertaining and maybe even a little bit educational, like, oh, here's what I learned doing this this week, you know, something like that. But I hope that by kind of shifting focus, it will allow me to make videos more frequently and maybe even make better videos because there's less of a pressure of me like kind of creating something because I've already made the thing and now I just have to catalog the events of me making the thing which to me it for my brain it just seems easier so i don't know I, I guess that's that's kind of the announcement i guess is that it's been a year and i'm glad and i'm excited and i'm proud of myself that i've been able to make it this far and i want to keep going just in a bit of a different direction than i have been and i hope that i'm still able to make it entertaining so in summation the video essays are going to stop for right now or at least be put on some kind of hiatus. And it's going to be a lot more of just, here's what I made recently. And I hope that I'm able to make that engaging or relatable or some something, something that people like to watch. Who knows? I mean, I've always wanted to make a game. Maybe I'll finally do that and I'll just do like devlogs or something, you know, who knows? So we'll see. I'm excited for what the future has to hold. So for those of you that have watched and listened, thank you so much. And I hope to continue to see you in the upcoming videos as things grow and change. Thank you so much for your time and have a wonderful day.